in this video I found out how to connect Oculus Link to the Quest 2 with a USB free cable instead of the you know expensive 89 pounds one I mean if you've got the money potentially anyway so first of all you need to go to oculus.com forward slash rift forward slash setup now you can just google it or you can just click the link in the description down below so then you're presented with the get started with rift download oculus software to find friends and other things and well play the games you know download oculus rift software click on that button once you've downloaded it go to your download folder click on the oculus setup dot exe and i've got two because i downloaded it twice once that's opened up you'll get your little o oculus symbol and then it'll say welcome to oculus and then get started click on the gr green click on the blue button review your terms and conditions you can read them i didn't then click install now there isn't an option to install anywhere else it just seems to pick your program files which is a bit of a shame because i do like to put mine on a different drive doesn't seem to let me do that and then it starts to install the software i found that if you have your usb cable connected it errored for me um so i disconnected the cable and it seemed to work okay but that might just have been just me or just an, an error in general it might just been a matter of luck that the cable when it was connected didn't work and then when i tried it again without it connected it did work so that's just a matter of you know first of all it is saying install but it's actually downloading it first this takes a bit of time it's 5.6 one 5.16 gigabytes so it just depends on your internet speeds once it's downloaded then it actually starts to install and then once you've installed you can click next and then it'll want you to log in with facebook or if you've got an oculus account but when i went to the oculus try to so when i tried to sign in with an oculus account or sign up with an oculus account it wanted me to then put my facebook account in anyway so it really wants you to have facebook which is sort of annoying but what can you do then you can choose your avatar now it selects your facebook avatar if you've logged in with facebook which is why i've bled out um but i ended up picking a fox and then you've got your privacy settings now i thought this was quite thing is the fact that do you want all your friends on facebook to know that you're playing a certain game or that you're you know your gamer tag or you know any of that so i i put only me for all of these settings and then you have to pick where you want to download your vr games so I picked the different drive that I normally would do. If you click the grey box um, to change location, that's how you do that. I just I always pick my second drive because that's the one where I put all my games on. It's the one that's got the most memory. Then once you've done that, you click confirm. You can then select your headset. Obviously, I've got the Quest 2, so I selected Quest 2. And then this is where it says about connecting your cable connection now i had a usb c to usb c so i tried that first but it is it's it's not really designed for the like the thickness of the of this bad boy i bought this one on amazon i will put a link in the description down below it is an affiliate so if you do want to you know support the channel in any way click on and buy it through that that would be fantastic thank you very much anyway so this one is an anchor uh, cable which it does say it works and it does it connects no problem as i said when i first connected this um i connected it through the usb c to usb c cable and that didn't work i had well it did work but it kept on giving me the amber light that it just wasn't happy with it was connected and it did work but just for reassurance i just wanted to go with something and this was 12 pounds compared to the 89 pounds of the oculus official link however there is a reason i think for that and the fact that this will give you about 2.6 gigabytes of, sp of speed coming through it whereas the oculus quest gives you the 5 gig so th the there might be a there might be a slight advantage or well, double the advantage 
with a proper cable so it, i mean if you do have the money and if you have tried it let me know in the comments if you've got the official cable whether you notice a substantial amount of difference between that and this one i keep waving this around i don't know why but anyway once i connected this one we <clears throat> one second once i connected the cable the, the sound went anyway once you connected the cable you don't get the amber light anymore and it seems to work perfectly fine i don't see i don't notice any speed differences but i suppose if you've got the official one you might notice a, maybe a slightly better connection which would maybe justify the 89 pounds if you did and you do like a lot of the fast paced game i've played beat saber and i can't i can't notice the difference it seems fine Anyway, thank you very much for watching, guys. If you like this video, please give us a big like. If you want to see more videos like this, let us know in the comments. And if you've tried the cable, what do you think? Thanks for watching, guys. See you in the next one. Goodbye.